Hello ladies and gents, welcome on back to Spaceborne 2. In this episode, we're going to take this beast out for a little spin in the Council Management Application. And we're going to mix it up. I don't know about you guys, but yeah, I'd be one of those captains. I would fly out to the outside of my command bridge and I would look in. Call it a personality flaw. Who knows? We got us a big ass fight today. We are going to be using the mothership and all of its drones and its weapons and everything else. So, I thought we would start. Jump in here before we take off. So, you know, we got, it's the basics that it came with. I mean, look how small this stuff is. I was like, and it's still 300,000 with all the bonuses and everything that I've got. But we've got the uh, engine burner and the aim extender. Those are going to make a real big difference in the movability of the ship. Oh. Landing. So, as we're going, I might not call it out, but you guys will want to pay attention. Oh, wow, it didn't push this quarter of a mile out this time. To the top of the screen. Because there's going to be stuff like that going on the whole time. And you especially want to push out for this, because the way this works is it has automatic, de automatic defenses. So, it might make it a little rough if you're too close in trying to see all the ships, because all you can really do is spin. Weapons online. Once we turn all our weapons online, you can see everything over there on the left side. But first, we got to make it through the Stargate, and that is a challenge. But... Ooh, she is a, uh, a, a squeaky old girl, isn't she? Anyways, come on. There we go. Whoa. Everybody in the ship threw up. Yeah, I would not want to be anybody but the pilot on what you guys are about to see as we go through this combat coming up because it would make everybody on the ship so sick. Oh, yeah, all the houses are fighting now. All the small ones. And my houses, the three that I built, have all kinds of money and they're doing great. So one thing you want to keep in mind is if you do the control H to jump systems, you've got to be within like 3000 kilometers and it drops you at nine. So we got to push on in here before we can even get permission to jump. And then we've got to actually jump correctly. All right. So we're going to go like this because I, we got to freaking shoot the needle here. Let's see how close are we? Oh, we're getting there. Please approach to the jump point to start jump process. Hold on to your butts. Please proceed through the gate in the path reserved for you. <laughs> we just threw the whole, threw through the whole bottom of it. Okay, well. <laughs> Uh-oh. No, we're gonna clip through that too. Let me try that again. It helps if I turn the power up in my engines. There we go. We'll see if we can get through this a second time. And actually hit what we're supposed to. Ooh. 
We'll go in a little higher. Alright. E shoot the needle. You reached the waypoint of your route. Please wait for your ship to be scanned. Exit permission from the system has been obtained. The next waypoint is being passed. N3, 2, 1. Destination reached. Okay. Let's see what are we looking at. Oh, there it is. Let's get our kids with us. Oh, oh, that's where we're going. Okay. God, I just, it makes me feel so old listening to this beast calibrated. grunt and groan for us. Calibration completed. Waiting just wait. Mm hmm. Okay, so there's the other ship, and we just gotta fly up next to it. Alright. Now, at this point, hopefully your character has plenty of ammo or really good armor. I have really good armor because we've got a lot of fighting. If we want to do it, um, we got to go have a chat first, and things are going to get nuts. And then there's a weird bug, and I'll talk about when we get to it. It doesn't really do anything to the game, Whoa. but see all this? It's about to change. But yeah. Got to hit F there. Okay. Is it me? Does he sound like a alcoholic beverage? Maybe skincare product. I don't know. That name is weird. Ah, you finally arrived. Welcome aboard. I hope your journey here was uneventful. Yeah, what's up with the secret? Uh oh. Stinger. Okay. Indeed. The faction meeting still stands. However, what we need to discuss here cannot be addressed in such an open forum. It's a matter of delicate strategic importance. Let's cut straight to the chase. The galaxy is in a state of flux. The Xegon's control over systems and their influence is decreasing. We need allies who will support our policies in the Galactic Council. Okay. If only it were that easy. Let me summarize the situation for you like this. There is a serious obstacle to World Resistance Army's application for membership in the Galactic Council. The problem is here. They are not a faction, but a company. Yeah, a company. They have mercenary services, okay. arms dealing, and interstellar transportation. Their influence is vast, and to them we pose a threat. This company is gradually increasing its influence over the Council. They are using all available strategies to obtain advantages over factions that decline collaboration with them. I'm sure they are actively plotting against us, even as we speak. Yeah, how are we going to plan to convince them otherwise? Before we proceed, understand the gravity of our situation. This company, through their operations, has made it clear they will stop at nothing to maintain their grip on power. Wait, do you hear that noise? Okay, so this is the bug. It's weird, right? So if you go in your settings, you can turn up the gamma. That way you can kind of see when it lets you get up. And now we gotta shoot our way out. You can shoot your way out if you want. My ship is being destroyed. I retreated to yours. Let's continue Let's after you see. beat them. Yeah. 
We, we could use another level here when it comes to... Look on that! Jeez, and... Oh, they did come in! Okay. They didn't come in last time I tried to pull them. Uh-oh. Don't worry, though. There are plenty of guys to shoot. Yeah, because there's no countdown or anything on the time uh, on the game, so... Where'd they all go? There they are. to get some. Ha-ha! <laughs> Took his head. Ooh! Ammo crate! If you uh, want the experience, you actually have to kill them. Uh, oh, he can shoot me, but I can't shoot him, huh? We will take everything because we are so freaking broke, it's not even funny. Now, if you don't want to fight these guys, you don't have to. You can literally run through that whole section and never get hit. Okay, hold on a second here. Let's turn this back down. Whoa! See what I mean by the bug? Well, that's a little more similar. Almost kind of got to turn the game completely off. Alright. Now for the second part. But yeah. So you hit your jetpack when you hit this area, you zip right through that area we just shot everybody up. You can run straight through it. I did when I did it on my test. All right. Now we've got to survive this next part. And things are going to get interesting. Weapons online. All right. So. All right. F. Three is combat drones. You can see we got all of our stuff going here, firing. There's the drones, F2, and then F1. Shoot whatever's near us. I mean, they're trying to keep them above us is not easy. Target shields down. Target destroyed. Let's see. Do anything. 
Target shields are down. That's so annoying. Target All destroyed. Right. Only got one. We. Kinda, I guess, as it's shooting, Target point everything destroyed. at it. Okay. You don't want to use too much of your ship energy because we've got some big boys coming in next. Don't worry about those paws. We can't pick them up. Target destroyed. Okay. Destroy these cowards, my friend. Show them the result of attacking from behind. Recharging. Oh. Man, it's like it kind of works, kind of doesn't. Although they are coming up with an update that's supposed to change a lot of this. Target shields are down. There we go. Target destroyed. You just destroyed one. Are there two more? Hang on, my friend. Attack formation. Alpha squad. Cover formation. Yeah, this is like, uh Shields are offline. Target destroyed. I like how they get... Um, missiles, but we don't. Jeez, when this thing spins, it really likes to spin. Wow. Okay. Oh, there. Oh, we are not doing good. A dreadnought? I told you this company shouldn't be underestimated. Yeah, let's let's get everything fixed up a second here before we screw with them. And now we can really move. Take a little bit of a trip. around in a second. And where did it go? All right, let's kill this sucker. You gonna wear us down then attack? That ain't cool. Yeah, the drones don't work real well. But again, like I said, this is part of a major update that is coming, so. Attack formation. A 
contact with my target. Yeah, why don't you guys try doing that? Instead of just having me sit here getting stomped on. Really? Boys are pretty talented. We can just sit here and give them a sec and see how they do. See if we can get our shields back up. Yep, there we That's go. That's what I'm talking about. Now let's warp out my friend. After that, you can find me on your ship to talk. Okay. Again, we are broke. But don't worry, as soon as the new update comes out. I'll update you guys as always. Alrighty. Bloody mercenaries. They did this. I know it. It's not time to calm down. I am saying it. We need to wipe them all. They will continue their activities as long as they encounter no obstacles and will remain a threat. This also means that World Resistance Army cannot enter the Council. So think twice, my friend. This is a matter of concern for both Okay, us. who are we killing now? I recently received an intel from my agency that this company has been transporting a large amount of luxury food. The intel mentions a smuggler named Malaris. You could go to her to get information about this shipment. I suspect they are organizing a meeting. This could be a great opportunity for us. If this Malaris knows someone of rank among them, we could exploit this meeting as a leverage point by striking at their weak links. By the way, thank you for your help. Without you, we would be drifting in space right now. Good luck, my friend. Okay, so you can take this monster with you to run missions. Or you can take it back to your station or wherever you had a dock before and get another ship. I'm probably just going to take this back to my home system. Oh no, wait a minute. I liked where I had it. Yeah. Because that's a good point for me to go to because there's a whole bunch of upgradeability stuff there. I don't know about this monster, but I don't got the money for it. Just putting anything on my ship now is going to kill us, so money wise. Let's try this again, see if we can do a little better this time. Please approach to the jump point to start jump process. Please proceed through the gate in the path reserved for you. Oh no! Alrighty, folks. Well, there we go. We had our first big monster fight with the mothership. Next couple of missions will probably be back in our fighter. But they're new, so you want to make sure you tune on in. Oh, good. It is repairing it, or it's trying to. Oh, I hope so. You got a little chewed up. Anyways, folks, keep your head down. Your ships of doom up and all. See you again real damn soon.